temperature and humidity controlled. We have a little chart over here uh, that gives us the moisture content reading inside the wood based upon the atmospheric conditions. So we're able to really regulate everything. Um, if you look up close to one of the pieces here on the ends, you can see the date that the wood came into the room and the weight that it came in at. So when we get our pallets of wood in, we'll hand weigh and grade every single piece, and then we'll sort them out. From there, when they get called upon to be used, uh, Gus, our, our lathe technician, will come in here with the order sheet. He knows what piece of wood he needs. Pull it off the rack. He'll reweigh it to make sure it's within a safe, usable uh, weight range to give us the, the right result. And we'll just take it out there and throw it in. If you, you, you can kind of see some of the letters starting to pop in. You can see the smoke kind of coming off the bat as well. And that little white spark, that's where the lasers actually make a contact with that wood and it's basically starting a little mini fire. How long does it take to etch one bat? Um, if it's like a regular game bat, uh, that's about two minutes. If it's a trophy bat that has a little bit more text on it, sometimes they'll have a logo on there. Uh, those can take about four minutes, maybe five minutes.